Good evening, I'm Hallie Pilot. Last night marked Indiana's debut of the Legacy Project. The Legacy Wall features information on famous historical figures who were part of the LGBTQ community. Over 65,000 people have seen the exhibit since it started in early 2015. Some people stand there and weep um, because they didn't think they'd ever live long enough to see something like this come into existence. Many people come back four and five times because there's so much content. The exhibit is in Bloomington at the Indiana Memorial Union through February 3rd. Well, the city of Bloomington says private developers charged with building the section of I-69 from Bloomington to Martinsville won't complete the project until at least August of 2018. But the state says that information is incorrect. The city says Isolux Corson told them of the construction delays today during a private meeting. But the Indiana Finance Authority says the city's information is incorrect and the expected completion date of Section 5 is still October of 2017. Well, lawmakers are backing a bill that would let Hoosiers be prescribed glasses or contacts online. The service Opternative offers online vision screenings, but optometrists are saying these services may be dangerous. We're not comparing apples to apples. You know, even though the company that's out there doing it right now calls it an eye exam, I could never do that and call it an eye exam. You know, it is not an eye exam. It is one minimal service that is a tiny part of that comprehensive eye exam. Alternative offers its services in 39 states. And a look at tonight's forecast, mostly cloudy with a low of 39. And taking a look at the five-day forecast, tomorrow it warms up a little bit with a chance of rain. And Thursday through Sunday, we're looking at temperatures in the 30s with a chance of snow. For more local news, go to WTIUNews.org and catch Indiana News Desk Fridays at 6.